Hi everybody, welcome to I think the 12th and final video for karaoke a retrospective and um, we're doing our final yeah not we're I'm doing my final uh, last couple of minutes to sort of wrap things up and I hope everybody's enjoyed these videos I hope everybody gave it gave every one of these videos an honest watch um, because this this is my karaoke history, and I've, you know, looking back on it, I love to do karaoke. Like, like I never thought I could, you know, come out and have this much fun at bars than I have. Um, that being said, though, um... This will be the sort of final time that I'm going to be doing something like this. Like after, after I end karaoke sessions to come back, I'm officially done with karaoke. Like for good. Um, there is a thought in the back of my mind just now that um, I can beat this truck here. Where, um, where I will come out regularly to bars, but not do karaoke. Um, as I've developed a much more mental, a much more mature mentality, and just want to actually. When I actually come out and experience karaoke and not actually be karaoke, um, 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 I'm going to finish up with these last couple of uh, bullet points here and hopefully we'll get my mentality back on track to, uh, to say what I want to say about this session, the, this series, this, I want to call it a mini series, but it's not really a mini series. With the amount of, with the limited amount of karaoke nights, it is sort of a limited series. But at the same time, it's still, it's still a main series because I'm teaming it up with, I'm pairing it up with, uh, Kingston sessions and karaoke sessions. <laughs> So, uh, so yeah, um, last month, alright, last, last, last month I found my list of all my most recognized people I've met, I made, sorry about that guys, recognized people I've met and made acquaintances and friendships with at the bars. Knowing, knowing I'm missing a vital piece of the puzzle, um, people's interest in me doing karaoke again, I asked them questions regarding what they thought of me when I first came to do karaoke, and if, and if they missed me enough to maybe want to see if they want me to return to karaoke because I spent all this time focusing on my side of karaoke and didn't take into account theirs. Um, throughout the last year and a half, I practiced all 16 of my showcases, 16 including the parody night, um, as a way of getting the hardest part of the background work done. Um, uh, leaving the option of like discarding the option of practicing my parodies the day of and going into the night sounding bad, sounding hoarse, like my voice would give out halfway through, stuff like that. And I'm making sure 
that everything will be covered from the practicing songs to making mini set lists for all the artists, uh, song availability, the whole nine yards. So, and um, this is something, this is something I sort of need to invest into. Like, I've spent this much work since I retired from karaoke to come back to karaoke. And I don't want it all to be a pipe dream. What I mean by that is that I don't want to do all this work for nothing. I want to actually see this through. Like I spent, like I said, I spent a year and a half working on making a bigger, better comeback. And um, I want to, I want to still continue to show people that I can, that I have the, uh, that I do have the ability to do, let's say I have a couple female artists on the, uh, the showcase list. I want to be able to prove that I can be able to, to go out and do songs by female artists and make sure that I knock it out of the park. There's also artists like, you know, there's Michael Jackson and there's Queen on the list and Linkin Park. You know, Freddie Mercury, Michael Jackson, Chester Bennington, all really hard vocalists to really do justice. And I want to try to make sure that I come out, honor, honor their memories, and try to do the best I can with... Good. Really try and do my best with these songs that, and the artists that uh, I'm showcasing. So I just want to give it my all, give it my best, and finally be able to close, to officially close the chapter, and I'm not trying to say this in a bad way, but make karaoke part of my past instead of my present and I once I leave I will always forever respect the people that I've met in the bars I will never forget about any one of you um why is this sounding like a suicide note um it, it's not though I promise um, so, yeah, um, there's still, if I get all of these videos posted on Thursday, Tuesday and Thursday, um, then there's a limited amount of time to vote. I really respect everybody's opinion, and I hope that I actually hear from you guys and get your input and get your your feedback and your thoughts and your love and you know I miss the camaraderie of some of the great moments I've had at these bars and enjoying singing all these great duets um, I sang more than about 400 a, a little bit more than 400 uh, cover songs I've done about maybe maybe 50 or 60 of my song parodies at the bars and um, you know this is sort of like the legend is coming back like like waiting for that next Eminem album or that next Weird Al Yankovic album or waiting for a new album from an artist that we haven't heard in a long time um, and this time I think I'm finally ready to accept karaoke back into my life, but at the same time, I'm going to take this off, at the same time, I do recognize that this is not 
the the life that I want to have you know coming out and always doing karaoke um, I'm returning to karaoke sessions a karaoke veteran I have five years under my belt um, and I just want to continue to do the best I can um, I don't know what else to say um, uh, the karaoke per the karaoke people and the karaoke singers and from all five years and two months of the bars I really want to uh, hear your feedback and um, as much as I put in this work practicing all these songs I first I practiced all the artists first when I was at Sherman Court um, I literally practiced I literally started practicing my artist showcases the day after we me and my mother got all of our stuff in the new apartment and I just finished practicing all of my artist showcases a third time early this year early this month so I've put my practicing in I put all the work in and I just want your feedback and I want you to vote for those artist showcases and I really want your guys' opinion on you know I'm coming I think I'm coming back regardless because I'm having to rush these videos out but I still would like everybody's opinion whether it be good or bad I don't care if I got a nasty message like you know don't fucking message me anymore I don't care if I get those kinds of responses but I just want everybody's feedback honestly and genuinely and just uh, try to be humble about it just like I'm trying to be humble about it right now um, I don't want this comeback to tarnish my legacy or like it's like the champ it's like uh, let's say the champion of like let's say Tom Brady for instance or, or, or Peyton Manning or whoever uh, retiring from football but then coming back to do one last season that's what I feel like like this upcoming new spin-off series will be it will be a champion coming back for one last run hoping everybody sticks with them you know like that's what that's what this series is to me and um, I hope I get your respect on this I hope I get your feedback um, and uh, just watch some of my old karaoke videos some of the videos you guys are into that I've posted that I've actually personally messaged to you over the oh, over the years and Um, I'm just like maybe four minutes from home, so, yeah, this will be like a 17, 18 minute video, um, but, um, yeah, I just want to thank every single one of you for taking a chance on me and proving that a good guy who doesn't drink alcohol can really make it in the bar life and that I was a, that I'm a good singer I'm still a good singer um, but I, I ended songwriting at the end of 2018 and I want to try and you know do the best I can with what I'm giving myself and uh, I just uh, I don't know why I'm, I'm thanking everybody because it's like the the last video um, and uh, I just want to create a little bit more karaoke history I have it in me to really 
do a lot with what I'm given and what I'm giving myself with uh, making this uh, this karaoke spin-off and um, whether you hate me, whether you like me, whether you were friends with me or whether you're still friends with me, um, I really, there's a part of myself that respects, appreciates, and values every single person I've met there at all the bars and every single moment, good or bad, that's been made. Um, um, I'm sorry I'm saying I'm a lot. I just trying to reach in my brain for something to say. Because I, I feel like I've said it all in this in this four hours of walking that I've been doing over the past three days. Um I really miss the moments, I miss everything. Um and um I just hope that you guys are uh, on my side when I make my karaoke return. So, so yeah, the uh, yeah, the uh, the King's End Sessions playlist is down in the description. The King's End the the King's End Sessions carry special. All the videos from uh, from carry that I have. And, uh, hopefully all the, uh, subsequent memorial sessions I'll try and, uh, put in the playlist as well that I have posted. Um, I have the karaoke sessions, uh, playlist. I have the, uh, mini sessions special playlist down there too. Um, so... I hope everybody can enjoy the work that I've put into recording these videos for uh, a show for the YouTube channel, EA Starting Channel, um, and I just want to make sure that I end this on a high note and not a, not a mean note um, about a about a half a block away from home so I want to thank everybody that's viewed these videos that has really taken a chance on me on my personal life to get to know me uh, I gotta watch because Lincoln Street's busy at this time alright I'm good um, and I want to thank you for being uh, part of my life as um, as karaoke can be and as the bars can be um, I'm walking into the comeback a, uh, a proven veteran a karaoke veteran and I I don't know what to say so uh, um Hope everybody's doing well. Um, no harshness or hatred meant by any of the things I've said in any of these videos. This has just been a chance for me to recollect every single moment that I've ever spent at the bars and all the memories that I've uh, all the memories that I've made and all of the uh, all of the feelings that were shared. I think I said all the friendships that were made. But, um, but yeah, this has been karaoke retrospective. Um, it's been a long journey, and I'm glad that, uh, I'm glad this journey is, uh, coming to an end. So, uh, yeah, like I said, YouTube, Facebook, the playlist is down in the description. Um, This has been Karaoke a Retrospective, um, and I'm looking forward to 
starting karaoke sessions to come back. And I promise you, it's going to be big. The first session will literally blow your mind about how how much how much better I've written songs after I ended bars. Um, and uh, have a good night, everybody. Day, night, whenever you need us. This is Evan for EA Star and Channel. Signing out.